when we first, bro, we would go out. Not only that, they saw us as a whole outside of not and for, for lack of never Florida, you know. What I mean, they always respect. They knew exactly what it was. But outside, you know, we went out, man. We was a clown show. Oh yeah, that was one thing. That was something that, and that's also a part of a part of our history that that we don't, cause we don't speak on it. But that never gets spoke on. But you know, what I mean, when we first came out, we was, you know, us the guys from New Orleans with the long shirts. The and the, and, yeah, the long shirts and the Reeboks, and you know, to the to New York, to New York and LA, they look Reeboks. You know what I mean? They looking at it like what? They look, them long ass shirts, them big ass jeans, them bandanas, and y'all got every different color bandana. You know what I mean? So they really not understand. They, they really so imagine that today. Imagine that's what I just said. Imagine that today. We'll, we'll be looking like, what the hell y'all doing? What you banging? What you? Right. It's gonna, oh, Lord, they got camouflage, right? They saying they soldiers, Lord. <laughs> right. You know what I mean? Yeah. So now that they real, we was a, what? If, if, if we ain't about to, until Juvie say, back that ass up, till that song come on, they ain't gonna hear nothing about nothing about nothing. Ain't y'all got, we was looked at as the New Orleans Two Live crew. Really? Oh yeah, we was looped. How, how did so? What, what were those conversations like amongst y'all though? Because the was, one thing cats from New Orleans don't want to do is feel played. They feel played. Like that's the yeah. I, I have that conversation multiple times with them. Yeah. I be like, bro, like I'm cool, I'm chill. Bro, just don't play me. Fortnet called. I get Facetime by Leonard Fortnet. Shout out Fortnet. I get a man Facetime me at least twice a week just from feeling played. You don't want to feel played. <laughs> yeah. Say, bro, I tell these dudes. <laughs> <You're> right. <laughs> right. Yeah, so like, how, how did, what was those conversations like it amongst was, y'all? Because y'all knew y'all had the skill. Yeah. Y'all was, understood that. That's what it was. It was just, you know, no, trusting Baby and Slim, trusting that, trusting that vision, and them knowing that they're going to put us in, the, like coaches, knowing they're going to put us in the right position, we just got to hit the shot. And that's, we were so motivated, like, you know, that chip on your shoulder, you know, that whatever, rather, you know, how the Chiefs are, rather we got the, the, the Warriors, rather we really got a chip or not, yeah. that we had one, because we already knew for a fact that, okay. And then, you know, we had to perform. What I mean by that is, when we on stage performing, they literally looking at us like, you know, like, man, get to the song that we know. Right. You know what I mean? And so we had to make that, and I can, it was awesome to do so. And it all happened genuinely, happened organically, you know, for each and every one of us.